It's me, Anthony Coach, and since this channel is growing, some people have been coming back to me in the comment section saying that I look a little bit like Paul Gilbert. That's okay by me, that is okay by me. Uh, maybe if I practice enough, one day I will also sound like him. So what I've done is I've chosen one lick which I think is the most versatile and worthwhile lick. Yeah, I mean, if you want to learn how to do it, go straight to the horse's mouth. Watch those videos on YouTube. What this video is about is someone like me, a super fan of Paul Gilbert, I'm a funnel and I've watched all those instructional videos and I'm just going, guess what, this is what I think the one thing you should learn. I'm like a funnel, like this, okay? And it sounds a little bit like this. Here we go. So up with the tad then. There it is, the lick, it's very short. But it's something that you can adapt and change and move up and down the neck and change key and all that stuff. So fret 12, finger 1, string 1. Okay, let's do that again. Okay, and, and that's an up pick actually, that's an upstroke when you pick it. And the entire lick, just like a lot of the stuff that Paul Gilbert is famous for, is just alternate picks. So I'm not going to really mention the picking too much I don't think. Uh, unless I need to, it's just straight up alternate picking. Uh, little finger, fret 15, string 2. Uh, then 14, 12 with finger 3, then 1. So then you get this. And then you just walk straight back up. So then everything. And that just repeats. And you can just play it, you can just leave the lick there and just play that, that works. Oh dear me, you can also get it cleaner than that. Can I though, that's the question. No is the answer. And you could just leave it there, just play just that very short phrase and just link all that together and just add that. and just add that as your lick. But what I've done is I've, uh, this is where I've adapted it. You just move everything up two frets, but you've got to change the finger pattern or else it won't sound in key. You'd end up with this, which doesn't sound in key. Unless your song changes chord and you want to change key accordingly. Uh, but to keep it into valic, Up on the tab, you'll see fret 14 with finger one, then fret 17 with finger four, then fret 15 with finger two, then fret 14 with finger one. But then it's the same principle, you just walk straight back up that one. And that's the entire lick. Let's hear it a little bit slower. So on and so on. And you can get it faster and cleaner than that, I'm certain. And the reason why I've chosen this guitar lick, uh, specifically uh, out of the entire back catalogue of instructional videos that Paul Gilbert has ever produced, is just because you can, just because of that reason that I've done that, I've moved it intervallically, because you can do that to any of his licks, but I just think this is like a bit of um, an easy in to that really fast shred playing that I'm trying to get involved in, you know, all that, all that really super fast playing. Oh, nice little note there at the end. And what begins to happen when you get a bit more confident with it is you can just change it and adapt it as you should be doing with any lick that you ever learn. So what starts off as something like... Uh, 
become something like. And so on and so on with the random shred nonsense. Uh, and just, you just mess around with them and practice them and change them and adapt them, make them your own. So what do you think? you think that is the most uh, useful Paul Gilbert lick? Am I wrong? Is there another one that I should have featured? Let me know in the comments. And if you like this video and you like videos about guitars and stuff and maybe some stupid dressing up videos when someone's desperate for views, <laughs> then, then why not consider subscribing to my channel? Because uh, then you'd be updated every single time that I upload something stupid or something serious or something teacher lesson -y -ness -ness -ness. Give it a go. Subscribe if you want. Uh, I've been Anthony Coach. Thank you very much for watching.